These paints may look the same, but they're very different. We have a flat, eggshell, satin, and semi-gloss. And all of these are great choices, but how do you choose what goes in what room? When it comes to bedrooms, it's always good to use flat paints. High glosses, on the other hand, are really good for kitchens and laundries. Why? Because it helps with the moisture in the space. When it comes to paints like satin, these are great for laundries and also trims, maybe a baseboard or the framing of a door. And when it comes to eggshell, well, this is something that you can use along baseboards and also in your laundry space. And then satin is really good for baseboards and doorways, etc. It just pops off the wall. So if you take your flat and pair it up with a satin, you're gonna see the color differences in the space. So here I go with a flat paint. And just say the flat paint here is on my wall. It's gonna have a really nice muted look. It's even, it's great. Then I'm gonna go with a semi-gloss for my baseboard. And when they butt up against each other, you really see the difference. Choosing different colors, pairing different hues together is really cool. But you can see the difference here with the flat paint, how it just looks very plain, and then the gloss, which really stands out. So in your spaces, you wanna go with the flat paints, do all your borders and your door trims in a high gloss, and really see the difference and contrast is there. But in a kitchen, we want to do your baseboards and your walls in a semi-gloss or a satin. So I would go with either a semi-gloss or a high gloss on your walls. Again, it really helps with keeping that moisture away. And then if you use, say, a satin on your baseboard, you're getting two different finishes. And that subtle difference in a room really just makes your room come alive. So when you're painting in your home, don't be scared to use paints. Try all different kinds. Just know the tips on where to apply them in each space.